Welcome to Saguaro High School for the Coaches for Charity Spotlight Game for October 5th, 2012. Tonight, Saguaro hosts the Palo Verde Titans. Palo Verde won the coin toss and started their first drive on the 10-yard line. Quarterback Nate Snow hit Chantre Luster-Smith on this 7-yard pass for a first down. Later on third down, Snow was sacked by Anthony Sabatino and the Titans were forced to punt. On Saguaro's first drive, they marched down the field, including this 12-yard catch and run by Joseph Grono. On second and goal from the five-yard line, Alexander Howe ran the ball up the middle for a touchdown. The point after attempt was no good, so with 6.07 remaining in the first quarter, Saguaro took a 6-0 lead. On Palo Verde's next drive, they moved the ball past midfield. With third and 11 on the 47, Cole Stearns intercepted the pass and took it 60 yards for a touchdown. The extra point was no good, and the score with 146 remaining in the first quarter was Saguaro 12, Palo Verde 0. On the first play of the second quarter, Saguaro had the ball, second and one on the 18-yard line. Quarterback Laramie Brown hit Derek Hall in the flat, and Hall scored the touchdown. Saguaro's try for two failed, and the score was Saguaro 18, Palo Verde 0. After a tighten punt, Saguaro moved the ball down to their own 49-yard line. The Cougars ran a pitch sweep to Jose Ruiz, who took it 51 yards for the touchdown. The point after by Nick Sisney was good, and Saguaro took a 25 to nothing lead. Palo Verde had the ball with a third and nine, the ball on their own 38-yard line. A pass over the middle was picked off by Sisney. Sisney returned it 43 yards to the seven-yard line. Then with fourth and goal on the two, Ruiz just breaks the goal line for the touchdown. The point after by Sisney was good, and the score was Saguaro 32 and Palo Verde nothing. Late in the second quarter, Saguaro mounted another drive. Brown connected with Grono, who made a great catch, then zigzagged his way down to the 19-yard line for a 51-yard gain. Then Brown hit Stern at the goal line for a 19-yard touchdown pass. Sisney with the point after, and the score at halftime was Saguaro 39, Palo Verde nothing. On the opening kickoff of the second half, Grono returned the ball to the 50-yard line. Nine plays later, Ruiz would take the toss sweep 12 yards for a touchdown. The point after attempt by Sisney was good, and Saguaro led 46 to nothing. Palo Verde's deepest penetration came late in the third quarter as they moved the ball down to the 25-yard line. The shotgun snap was high. Eric Bush picked up the loose ball and rambled 70 yards for a touchdown. The point after attempt by Sisney was good and Saguaro led 53 to nothing. On Palo Verde's next drive, there was another high snap. Bush chased it down again and would score yet another touchdown for Saguaro. The point after by Sisney was good and Saguaro led 60 to nothing. The Saguaro Cougars had no turnovers and no punts or field goal attempts in the game, which meant they scored on every possession except for killing the clock at the end of the game. Laramie Brown threw for 171 yards, and Joseph Grono caught four passes for 90 yards to lead the Cougars to a 5-2 record. Palo Verde committed five turnovers in the loss, and their record dropped to 2-5. Reporting for Coaches for Charity, I'm William Ackerley.